Hi, I'm Robert Williams, and this is Ask a Developer. Today's question comes from Andrew, and he asks, with so many new programming languages coming out, how do you keep up? So it's true, there are a lot of new languages coming out all the time. There's Dart, Swift, Hack, CoffeeScript, Ruby on Rails, Go, and it seems like something new comes out almost every day. I tend to Google a lot of things and read on sites like Stack Overflow, go to conferences, talks, meetups. There's a great community of developers, especially in the open source movement, and they're always willing to offer help. But there's really no way to keep up with every new framework. Still, the primary language we use in programming today is JavaScript. It's been around for almost two decades, and although a lot has changed over that time, the fundamental concepts have remained the same. In the past, to make web applications, you had to rely on a lot of different languages. In the front end, you'd need to use uh, Java or plugin-based technologies. On the server side, you'd use completely different languages. JavaScript has pretty much changed all of that, and at this point, it's become the primary language of the internet. New developments in JavaScript come out all the time. There are technologies like Node and Phantom that allow you to use the language on the server. New APIs are constantly becoming available that allow you to extend its reach. And we're just now seeing the new features of ECMAScript 6, which will be the next version of JavaScript. However, I still use many of the same concepts and techniques I learned in other languages. As one of my professors once told me, every new language I learn expands my knowledge in all languages. He was talking about foreign language, but I find the sentiment is just as applicable to programming. So don't worry too much about starting off on the wrong foot. The important part is just to get started and to keep learning. That's it for this Ask a Developer. Tweet your questions with hashtag AskADev or leave them in the comments.